Hey guys, it's Michelle, your favorite event designer. I have been an event designer for the past eight years, service in all of Georgia. So today we're going to discuss ways to cut your wedding budget. I know if you've seen these trends and how it is are 25, 30, 40, 50 thousand dollars. And let's talk about the ways we can cut that down. If you need reference, go back to my Trinity video so that way we can move past that. So here are the things that off the top that you should already know that we need to cut. Favors. Nobody cares. We end up throwing them in the trash can afterwards. Menus per guest. Pointless. They don't care. Um, a large cake. Have y'all seen those cakes where it's one, two, three, four, five, six tiers? First of all, you're not, we're not, the guests are not going to eat that much cake. Publix will be perfect if you want to cut there. Save the dates. What's the point of sending the save the date as a magnet? Because, girl, I'm going to take it off my refrigerator. I don't care. Just send me the invitation so I can RSVP and move on. I don't see the point of doing save the dates and wedding invitations. It's really no point there. So, guest books. Guest books are very old school. It's an old wedding tradition that before social media and all of those things, that people would keep up with the guests who came so they can write thank you notes. That's not needed at this time. And I promise you, I don't even know what my guest book is from eight years ago. I have no idea. I don't even remember who came to our wedding. But everybody got a thank you note. Also, ceremony heels. If you're not wearing a short dress, nobody can see your feet. Stop paying for those Jimmy Choo's and all of that. Girl, get you some regular shoes. Matter of fact, wear flats. More comfortable. Uh... I'm going to preface this lightly. Um, too many guests. Do you talk to 300 people every day? Do you talk to 250 people a day? Why do we need to have 250 people at your wedding? It's not needed. Last but not least. Last, last but not least. Girlies. This is the way you can get it. Do you know that every county around you has a rec center? that has a rental fee of below $2,000. And then you can hire a designer who can drape that thing off and make it like the most prettiest thing ever. So instead of paying four, five, six, seven, eight thousand dollars $8,000, you can pay $1,000 or $2,000. Cut a huge cost. All right, you guys, be blessed. I'll see you next time.